hundreds, if not thousands of Kelowna residents flocked to the corner of Abbott Street and Cedar Avenue on Saturday to take in the grand opening of the city's new waterfront park. This is an incredible day for Kelowna. It is a milestone uh, for city and council and uh, the KLO Association too, uh, and all the neighbours in the neighbourhood. Um, this is so exciting. I've been on council 12 years, and we have actually been working on this from the day one when I was a councillor. Uh, when you look at this beautiful, beautiful park, people realise what we do and when we buy up you know, different properties. And uh, yeah, and here it is, look at this, on the lake, we've got kayakers, we've got the whole, we got families, we've got people in the neighborhood, we got people from all over Kelowna. Kelowna Mayor Tom Dias was all smiles at the grand opening as everyone accessed the park. He tells Castanet it was the successful application for federal and provincial government grants that finally turned the park into a reality for years to come. In order to put, build this park, um, it, was, it, it was in excess of $6 million. Um, the city looked at putting in foreign a half million dollars. Uh, the provincial government uh, put in um, 750. The I mean, the federal government put in 750. The provincial government also put uh, money into it. And when they put their funds into it, it was grants that we applied for under um, things like accessibility, uh, so that we could have it, or or it, environmental impact. So applying for those grants allowed them to fit into this park, and allowed the end product which we see today. The new waterfront park is filled with all sorts of features, including pedestrian promenades, a naturalized beach, an urban beach, picnic spots, and a boardwalk. The park also includes basketball hoops, benches, a public pier, a misting station, a floating dock, and an accessible kayak launch. And there's also an extension that is happening to this. So where the paddleboard club exists at this point in time, that will be a future phase to look at extending and making this footprint even bigger um, and better for, for the community. Mayor and Council tell Cassinet the next step is to come up with a suitable name for the new waterfront park and that it will be discussed in future meetings. I'm Braden Ursel in Kelowna for Castanet.